Hey there, how y'all doing? This is Giovanni, hope y'all doing well. So as I'm meditating here um, on this early Shabbat, you know, I'm realizing, man, um, how much the Most High, how important it is for Him, the union of one man and one woman. How imp I never realized until recently how important marriage is to the Most High. And I have just recently came to the realization how important and how much He cares for these women. The importance for them to be monogamous, the, the women's. And I I know he's trying to tell us how he he wants for his believers to be always reminded that we only serve one Yah. Man, I'm contrasting this with society, the way they teach marriage, the way they teach what is a union between a man and a woman, and it is so watered down doesn't mean shit the most high cares so much about the union of a man and a woman that he said to the man boy you take that woman you take that virgin that woman that is untouched for marriage, you will not put her away all the days of your life. And he is so, in his amazing wisdom, profound, he is so wise and righteous and good that he said, you know what? I know, I know some of y'all, you are going to... Y'all aren't going to obey me anyways. Y'all going to do whatever you want. You want to put her away? No problem. Well, even though you put her away, you're still always going to be bound until the day you pass on, until the day you die. And if you put her away, and she ends up another man with another man because she's got a void that she needs to fill now. You're going to make her an adulteress. And he said, and he made it clear. He said, you want to put her away? All right, this is what's going to happen to her. You don't want to put up, you're tired of putting up with all this, her bullshit, her nonsense, her rebellion. Hmm? All right, put her away. This is what's going to happen to her. She's going to find another man that's going to take her. And he says, hey, man, you want to take that woman that's been put away? Well, hey, man, look at this. When you take that, that woman for yourself, she is going to become defiled. You're going to make an adulteress out of her. And you are going to become an, an adulterer. Because I am reminding y'all that my plan, my intent, and how much I love these women and my creation, the man also, and how I want you to be reminded that the importance of a union. I'm going to remind y'all that you want to do that. Then y'all are going to be defiled. That woman, you're going to make her defiled. So what do you think he's trying to tell us? What? So think about it, man. You're God, you, you, this woman, you, okay, she's divorced. She's put out. So think about this. You're this man. You're looking at this woman. And you're thinking, wow, what a beautiful woman, man. You know, I could, hmm, uh, hey, maybe, you know, she's got some great traits. Maybe, you know, you, 
man, I could, I could certainly, yeah, I, I'd take that woman in my life. Yeah, you want to do that? All right. Well, you're going to have a defiled woman. You're going to have a soiled woman. Because that woman wasn't created to receive only one man. Her whole life. So, I, that, this has got to be a test. And he's got to give us, he must have given us that to try us. You know he's trying us. Do you really love that woman? How, do you really love that woman or do you just want to fulfill? Feel your lusts. Because you know what? If you really love that woman, you're going to understand the intent of the Most High in that. You're going to be like, you know what, woman? You got married to that man being a virgin? Go back and get re reconciliated with that man. And you know what? If he even, if he truly even loves her, what he's going to do also, he's going to go and get that man and he's going to look, he's going to become a judge on the spot. He's going to go and inquire about that man. What's going on with that woman? Why isn't she with you? And if you see that man be a jack-legged, hypocrite, locked, Self, he's going to knock some shit out of that man. And he's going to say, you know what? That woman, she doesn't belong out on the streets. That is your woman for life. And also, he even said to the woman, woman, and she's constantly reminding us how important it is. You want to, be departed from your husband. You are departed from your husband. Whether it's him putting you out or you going out, you're going to stay and you're going to remain unmarried. You are not to go to another man until your husband dies. What do you think that does to us? What do you think he's trying to do to us? He's trying to get us to, to put our damn differences aside and get in check with ourselves and get in our damn roles, man. He's trying to get the woman to be reconciliated to her, her man and the man to show some damn compassion to that woman. Y'all get in your roles. Man. I give praise to the Most High. All praise to the Most High Yah. Man, he is, he's just too vast. Too vast. Hallelujah. I bless y'all.